Like Atlas. This is Reagan. Soundbite. I'd rather not. Well, here's where the majority of uh of the queue is going to. Currently, it's less than thirty minutes. Uh, I gotta W A L K the dogs at some point. Mm hmm 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 Oh, that was. We're listening to a chat pile EP. Oh no! Oh. Oh god! Oh, not this shit, man. I heard Rainbow Meat. That is that song haunted my dreams. Like genuinely, that shit, like that that shit, like haunted my dreams, bro. Oh man. This dungeon earth. So, uh, Jeremy, no, wait, not Jeremy, sorry. Uh, it was, I am not donkey, says Chat Pile's first EP, This Dungeon Earth. Um, what did you expect from Chat Pile? Not fucking send my body to Arby's, you know what I mean? Bro, that shit, that shit kind of fucked up. That one just did not last well with me. That shit kind of fucked me up a little bit, just a little bit, you know? Uh, I think I need a snack for this one, so uh, let's listen to something before that. Yeah. track face. Thank you, Hector. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah. 
forgot about that, Daniel. Or Danielle. I mean, look, it's dark, it's disturbing, it's fucked up, but I think my issue with this is it sounds like shit. And I and I think that part of that is intentional, but it's also really agonizing at the same time. Like, it feels like it was intentionally, everything is all mono and shitty. It's, it's demented as fuck, but I don't know, man. It's not really having the same effect on me, on me as, like, the other album is to where it's, like, it's dark, but I'm enjoying it. It's more like, it's dark, but I genuinely feel pushed away from it. I feel a strong shrug. They're definitely doing something here, but it's hard to really super appreciate it when I know they did it better uh, moving forward. Oh, it's on shuffle. My bad. Rainbow Meat! This is a song that exists. I did not see the Fantano video. I was hoping I'd never have to listen to this song again, you know? But, uh, but here we are.
Mr. White. Yeah, I hate that song. Um, it, it borders on being parody. It's definitely memorable, but I genuinely hate it. I hate the way that it's sung. I hate the way that it's performed. The whole thing is just disgusting for the sake of it. Um, man, it definitely gets a, it gets a reaction out of me, you know? I don't like it. Low shrug. Yeah, even for me, I think there's such thing as too much, where that song is just purely unfun. That's a word. You can't tell if I'm joking, that's fair. I've enjoyed stuff that's been this insane before, but, uh... Yeah, I think that I have to draw the line somewhere. That one is just purely just gross, and not even that great sounding. Next song, Rat Boy. Ah! Rat hates Radiohead confirmed, canceled. Confirmed. Rat homophobic. Mark, you defend me a whole lot for someone who basically is only in a one-way loving relationship. Uh, just, you know, just letting you know. Is Ellie the only gay here? Well, that was repulsive, um, much like many of the other songs here. 
uh, just like the previous one, I feel like listening to this grotesque shit that doesn't really provoke much of an emotional response besides disgust is hard. It's hard. It's tough to listen to. The shrug. Yeah, I'm just not as interested in this as I was with uh, their their debut album. Despite this being about ten times more unrelenting, it is effectively terrifying, but does not work as well as being music. So, still a fascinating listen. I mean, I'm glad I'm sitting here listening. It's the most challenging thing I've heard in a while. It really is, and I appreciate it for that. You know, it's been a while since I've heard something that's made me feel this uneasy in my own skin. So, you know, crawl space.
That was a breath of Jesus. It was a bit much. Shrug. I mean, I already wrote my review. Let me just tell you what it is. So it's a five minus for me, this project. Um, and I said this. This project is a bit much. I prefer them spending more time on strong song ideas instead of... Or song strong idea... Song, strong song ideas and sounds over shock value. This was disturbing, but not fun at all. I didn't find it to be a fun listen in the slightest. It just felt really uncomfortable. But it was one of the few times where it's like makes music that makes me uncomfortable where I'm not like happy because it's provoking some strong emotion. It just feels uncomfortable. Um, I feel like this is an interesting experiment. Uh, but not something that I feel like, like, it's something I feel like they did so much better with on, like, their debut. And even Dallas Beltway felt like it did this, but more well thought out. So, yeah. E. Not fun. <sighs> so boring. I mean, it's not, I wouldn't say it's boring, I'd just say it's a bit, a bit much.